Hi everyone, it's Desiree. Welcome back to my channel. Thanks for joining me for another video. Today I am cash stuffing for the week. I have $7.39 to put into all of my envelopes. So I'm going to first start off in my wallet. Oh, and I wanted to say, if you're not already, make sure to hit that subscribe button because I'm almost to 50,000. So that's super exciting. Um, so yeah, definitely subscribe if you're not already. I'd really appreciate it. It doesn't cost anything. It's free. Um, but yeah, that, that would be amazing for my channel if I could get there to 50,000. So, so yes, thank you if you're already subscribed and thank you if you decide to subscribe today. So I'm going to start off in my wallet. I have, um, some leftover money this week. I try my best to not spend everything. It's been like, a little challenge for myself because then I take this money and then I put it into savings. So um, in spending, and honestly, I can't even remember. Oh, I bought something on Amazon. That's what I did. I did that in an unstuffing video. So in spending, I had 30 and I um, now have left 10, 11, 12, $13 left. And this is just going to go into savings. So I'm going to put this off to the side. Oh, and I wanted to mention, I got this cute little cash tray. It's like a pretty green color. I will link the Etsy shop. There's a bunch of other colors that um, they sell on there. So I'll link it. The only thing is that it's really, it moves a lot. So I'm gonna have to get some little, like little rubber feet for the bottom, but then it'll be perfect after. Um, but yeah, I will link the shop uh, if you're interested in getting a cute little cash tray upgraded from my, the Amazon one though that I use is, is really good, but this one is pretty. So I just bought it cause it's, it's cute. Um, eating out. I went to eat out once, I believe. Yes. I ate out at work one time, but my boss paid for it. We had in and out so I didn't have to. I was planning on eating in and out later that day, but he bought it for us, so I didn't have to spend my money on it. And then I went to Taco Bell one night so that's, that's the only time I went out to eat. And my eating out is for like quick meals like that, like drive through fast food. Like I don't wanna cook kind of things. And then I have another, I have a fun envelope that I spend from when I actually wanna go out to like a sit down restaurant, cause that's more expensive. Cause $30 is not gonna cover a nice sit down restaurant with like tip and everything. So eating out, I have 10, 15, $16. So that's gonna go into savings as well. Groceries. I have $3. This money is going to go into Costco. I'm actually going to Costco today, so this will come in handy for that trip. I'm just going to put that to the side. Coffee. Okay, so coffee I had I had a little bit more this week because I in my YouTube paycheck, I give myself a little bit more in coffee, so I gave myself 30, but I didn't spend it all. I only reloaded twice. So I think I'm going to re Am I going to no, I don't need to. I'm just going to put it in savings. I was going to um, roll it over, but I didn't. So usually when I have that extra money in YouTube, or sorry, in uh, my coffee envelope, what I'll do is I will get a drink and a pastry. That's why I give myself a little bit more so I can treat myself to not just coffee, but a little treat. But I didn't do that this week because I actually made these really good overnight oats. So I was just eating that for breakfast at work and I didn't get a treat so that's why I have a little bit more left over because otherwise I would have spent this if I did get like a sandwich or a pastry but I didn't do that and I don't think I'm going to do that this week so I think $20 is going to be good so I'm just going to put that into savings too I have a new savings challenge I'm going to start so that'll come that'll go in there buffer which is my extra money this is like if I go over a budget in an envelope, I can use this. I have five, six, seven, eight, nine. So I only used a dollar from here this week and that'll go into savings too. Okay, so now I'm at the point where I can stuff my envelopes now and they're just gonna get the usual amount. So spending is gonna get 30. Eating out is gonna get 30. Groceries is gonna get 80. This is what I'm doing right after this is I'm gonna go grocery shopping. But I still need to make my grocery list and meal plan for the week, I haven't done that. Um, coffee is gonna get 20, so 
two tens. And buffer is gonna get nine. So five, six, seven, eight, nine. So I have five, six, seven, eight. Oh, sorry, it's gonna get 10, what am I talking about? So five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten dollars in buffer. Okay, and that's my wallet for the week, what I usually spend from before I dip into my other envelopes. So now I'm gonna go into all of these. I'm gonna start in the black one first. So auto repair, this week is getting $30. So 20 and a 10. All right, so auto repair has 1, 20, 30, 40, 41, 42. So 142 in auto repair. I'm just gonna write that down here. Christmas is gonna get 15. Okay, so 15. So now Christmas has one, 120, 30, 40, 45, 50. So 150 in Christmas. 150. Okay. Electronics is getting 28. So that's 20, 5, 6, 7, 8. Oops. I think I will have, yeah, I'm going to have over 500 now in here. So I will be able to take this back to the bank this week and put a placeholder. So um, in electronics, I have one, two, three, four, 450, 470, um, 490, 510, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. So 520 in electronics. Emergency is getting 20. I think I'm gonna be able to take this back too. I already have 500 in the bank. And now I have one, two, three, four, 450, 470, 490, 500. So a thousand total. So yeah, this is going back to the bank. Lots of money to take back to the bank. So that's good. That's a thousand. Extra debt is getting 60. So 50 and a 10. I actually still need to calculate how much I owe on this. So I already paid my debt off, but now I'm paying myself back because I use money that I want to just put back in the bank. And I think I paid off 20, around 2100 And I had, I took money from here that I was saving in February and made a payment. So that was 460 So I have 1640 around 1640 That's a, like a, a rough estimate of how much I need to pay myself back. So that's what this is going towards, paying myself back for that. Just to put it back into my savings account. So yeah, that's $60. Furniture is getting 20. It's so funny, I got a comment on my, on Instagram saying like, why would I need a furniture envelope? And I had to explain to them, I don't think they ever responded, but like everybody's life is different. Everybody has different journeys and I moved into my own place and I don't have a lot of furniture when it comes to my bedroom. So that's why I have a furniture envelope, you know? I don't have all the furniture I need and I plan on moving again and then hopefully into a bigger place and I'm gonna need even more furniture, right? So it's just funny how people just don't seem to get like, you know, this is all, you could tailor this to your life, like your needs. And what I do for my system doesn't mean that it's going to work for somebody else, you know? And I'm not here to like tell you what you need, like how exactly to do this. Um, I'm just showing how I do it. And then if you see things that you like that you can implement into your life, then that's great. Or you can get it from somebody else. Um, that's what I do. I watch a bunch of cash stuffers and I kind of take a little here, a little there, do my own little spin on things too, and make it my own. So, so yeah, I thought that was funny. It's like, why do you need a furniture envelope? Uh, so 100, 150, 170, 190. Okay, so that's $190. 
Rainy days getting 15. Okay, rainy day has one, 120, 30, 35, 40. So 140 in rainy day. 140 in rainy day. Road trip is getting $20. I have oh no I was like that's not it I know I had more than that okay 752 so I have 50 70 90 110 in road trip um Sensi is getting seven five six seven oops So now Sensi has 50, 60, 65, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75. $75. Subscriptions is getting 20. So subscriptions has 50, 70, 90, 100. This envelope is like, I messed up on this envelope when I made it. I tried a different way than what I did on my tutorial, and that was a bad idea. It's quite falling apart, so I need to fix those. So that's $100 in subscriptions. Treat Yourself is getting 30 I might take Treat Yourself, and actually I might buy myself from something for my birthday with this money. I think that's what I might do. I might buy like a new pair of shoes or something. Um, I have 100, 20, 30, 40, 45, 46, 146. I was going to, or maybe the glasses. I don't know though, because I haven't looked for sunglasses and I feel like just getting new pair of shoes is easier <laughs> right now. Okay. So that's treat yourself. And that one is all done in here. Next is this white binder. This one has like more of the envelopes that I use during the week. Um, okay, so beauty, like beauty, I have to take this with me and buy, buy something. Putting 15 into beauty. So beauty now has 50, 60, 65 in beauty. 60, 65. Content is getting five. The content has 20, 40, 65. 65. Clothing is getting 14, so 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Yeah, 14. Okay. Oops. 10 and the ones. Lots of ones in here. I need to. Condense this a little bit. 50, 60, 65, 70, 71, 72, 72, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80. 80 in clothing. Costco is getting 15. I'm going to Costco today, so this I will be using. Oh, and actually, sorry, it's getting another three too. So. Costco's actually getting 18. Let me just correct that over here. 18. So I have a total of 50, 60, 65, 66, 67, 68. Let me update that over here. 68. So, um,. I saw some things on Instagram, like uh, some of the reels that I watch are like food ones or like Costco, like what's new at Costco. So I saw something that I want to try to find there. I really don't need to stock up on too much when it comes to Costco, but actually I don't think I need to stock up on anything. Like my frozen stuff is all good still, but there's this like item that I'm trying to find there. I don't know if it's at mine. But if it is, then I'm going to use that for my either lunch or dinner. So I'm not sure yet. Um, but yeah, this one, we shall see what happens when I go to Costco. 
Okay, so Disney's getting 60, and I did three 20s. One, two, three. So that's 60. I'm going to Disney this week. 20, 40, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 81, 82, 83, 45, 6, 86 dollars. And Disney. Ooh. 86. That's more than enough, I believe. Family is getting 14. 1, 2, 3, 4. So family now has 20, 30, 40, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50. And family. Fun is getting 30. So now fun has 20, 30, 35, 36, 37, 38. $38. Gifts is getting 11. 10 and 11. Don't have any birthdays coming up really. Not until like June. <laughs> okay, so 20. I'm oh, sorry. 50, 70, 80, 90, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 100. So $100 in gifts. 100. Hobbies is getting 10. I have 10 in here, so now I'm at 20. $20 in there. Holiday decor is getting 5. So now I have 50, 100, 120, 25, 30. So 130. 130. Home decor is getting 5. So I have 50, 55, 60. Household is getting six. So now household has 20, 30, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40. $40. And then Target is getting... 20 and tar oh I have 20 so that's that's a total of 40 in target okay and then the last binder last binder for the day okay so this is got the challenges which I'm a little lacking in compared to what I used to, used to do but I have one that I'm gonna add in a little bit okay so I have this Go Wild one, which Go Wild is next month. It's a, you're not sure what it is, because um, it's part of my planning world stuff, but it is a planner conference that happens annually. And I've been going to it the past couple of years. Last year it was in DC, and the year before that was in Anaheim, and this year it's gonna be in Texas. So we all meet up, people from like all over, not just the country, like the world come which is super exciting because then I get to see all of my planner friends that I've made over the years and we get to hang out and we get to listen to speakers and actually this this go out even more excited because the keynote speaker is Martha Stewart which is like oh my goodness that's amazing <laughs> um, because I know Martha Stewart has like planners and things like that in the stores I've actually before I actually got into like happy planner stuff I would buy like some of her like organization stuff um and yeah I love her aesthetic so I'm so excited to hear to see Martha Stewart in person super cool so everybody's really excited about that but there's a bunch of other speakers too um and then we get like a bunch of swag and different things like that um so it's a lot of fun and it's coming up real quick. And I have things I need to do to prepare for that that I haven't done yet and I really need to get on that. Um, but this is the money that I'm saving for that. So right now I already paid for my ticket for the event and I already paid for my plane ticket. Um, what's left is my hotel, food, drinks, Ubers, um, 
and also I'm giving um we're doing like we do like little gifts and stuff so the money I need to spend for that so that's what this money is going towards so I have one two three four hundred four fifty four seventy four ninety five hundred so another five hundred that I can take back to the bank I've reached my goal that I originally set for myself which was twenty five hundred because I already have two grand in the bank um but I'm still going to be stuffing for this because honestly, more money is better than less. So I'm just going to keep going with it until I go on my trip. So I'll be stuffing in there still. Okay, and now I'm left with my savings challenges. So I'm going to move this aside. Um, and I'm going to first do roll the dice. Let me get my... Yeah, I'm so excited. So like all of this stuff you see here, like all of these zebras that I use all of these mild liners that I've used. I, yeah, all of this stuff, anything from Zebra, I got at this event because I usually sit at the Zebra table and I get stocked up on all these fun markers and pens and highlighters and stuff. So I plan on sitting at their table again because their table is always really, really good. So I'm excited to, to do that. Okay, so first I'm going to take care of this. So I have 17, so 10, 15, 16, $17, which is going to go in here. I'm almost done with this challenge. I think I might not have to roll. I might be able to just, well, we'll see. I don't know. We'll see. Okay, so this money's going in here. That's the 17. And then I'm going to color in all the dice from that roll. Okay. So I have two sixes here. So one, two. Looks like a nice little crow outside. Um, and then I have a five, which I think somebody mentioned like, oh, I, roll, I rolled a five, but I don't have a five. So what I do with that is I will just add it up to five. So I have all these ones, so that helps. And I have a three. So I'm gonna do three, four, five. All right, so I'm not left. Oh no, I do want to roll. Yeah, it's it's quite a bit. I thought I was like going to be a little bit closer to the end, but it looks like I have a good amount left. So I'm just going to roll. We'll see what I roll, and then we'll see if it covers what I need. Okay, so I'm going to roll three times. Okay, so six. I do have a six, so we're good. Six. Um, I do have a one, so we're good. And three, I don't have a three. And I have another one, okay, perfect. So that'll cover a six and two ones, and then a six and two ones. And then I'll probably will just not roll next time and be done with this. Just fill whatever I need that's left over and then be done with this challenge. So I have six, seven, eight dollars that I'm gonna be stuffing into this challenge next week okay and then 100 envelope oh you know what let me take care of this first so i have fives i'm gonna put these all in its correct spots ones because i have a bunch of tens too but i'm gonna start a challenge okay so i I planned for 25 so this 25 was going into this challenge but usually what I'll do is see if I have maybe a little bit more to stuff so I think what I'm gonna do I'll just do 29 because I want to start another challenge and I want to use these tens yeah and I don't have 35 I don't have 45 so I'm just gonna use these ones one two three four so it's a little bit more. Okay, so that's 25, 6, 7, 8, 9. Okay, so let me go to 29. This thing is getting so full. I'm going to have to change up this thing soon. Okay. Oops, 29. Okay, I'm going to just put this in here, but I'm not going to color in the tracker. I'll color it in later. So that's 29. Yeah, this thing's getting full. Okay. That one's done. 
And then I have the $5 challenge, which is going to be all these five. So I have five, 10, 15, $20. Oh, and let me get my green. I picked this green. And I like these because they're kind of glittery, which is fun. Okay, so I have four that I can color in here. This is from um, Plan with Elise. This tracker. Oh yeah, it's so pretty. This green. I don't know if you can tell, but it's kind of glittery. And it's pretty. Okay, so that's four of those for March. Okay. Okay, this is going to be my new challenge, which I actually made this challenge. Well, I put it together. I put this challenge together, like, placement-wise. Um, but my sister drew these cute little piggy banks. If you're not, if you don't know, like, my sister is super talented. She makes stickers for me. Like, she draws artwork for my stickers that um, I put on my Patreon. She's very, very talented. I can literally just tell her, like, I want this. And she will draw it and it'll be amazing and so i just told her like i want little piggies so she drew like the little cutest little piggies they even have like little eyelashes and stuff so i got a little piggy and um this tracker is actually available on my patreon as a download along with a bunch of other downloads i've been just kind of putting over there because people have been asking for them and that's just the easiest place for me to put them right now until i open a shop um but i have this cute little one on my patreon and over there i do take suggestions i've already got suggestions for new trackers that i'm going to ask my sister to drop some artwork for um so yeah i do take suggestions over there for any kind of tracker or any kind of thing that you're looking for so here what i think i'm going to do is i have this little piggy bank on the bottom to tell like what it's equal i should actually i'm gonna probably move this over and then do a, like a total one too like what the total will be after it's done. So I might make a little edit to this one and then put that up on Patreon. But for now, I'm just gonna write that this one is 10. These are gonna be $10, okay? Like, look how cute that is. They're so cute. And it gets cuter because I'm about to color them in. And I, I was coloring them in earlier just to test them out. And it's super adorable. So I'm gonna take these two colors to color in the little piggy banks. Uh, but I have three, three tens, so I'm going to color in three of these little guys. So again, I'm going to use my mild liners. I like the fine point tip on this one. And I have this pretty pink color, so I can color in this little cute guy or girl. It's a cute little piggy bank. Okay, got three little piggies. And then I'm going to take the green. I wish I had a better green. I might, but we're going to use this green for now. Oh no, this is a good green. It looks brighter on the, the cap. Okay, and there's my little piggy banks colored in. So that's $30 for this challenge. So I'll just be collecting tens in this one. But you can make it any amount. Like if you wanted to use this for your $5 tracker, you can totally do that if you want to make them higher amounts. $20, whatever it is. You can do that. But this will be my $10 tracker. All right, and then I have all of these ones left and I'm just collecting ones. Oops, oh, I need one more. I need one more little. Okay, let me go grab a little envelope. Okay, so I have one little envelope here. I'm actually gonna put it behind here. Okay. So ones, I have one, two, three, four, five, six left. 29, 30. Okay. Yeah, I'm just gonna put it in here. Okay. And I just collect these ones. This is what I did last month. I just collect the ones and I'm not tracking them. And then at the end of the month, I will just take that and it's probably gonna go into that debt when I'm paying myself back for debt. Okay. So that is it. Thank you so much for watching this video, for choosing to watch this video, especially all the way through. I really appreciate you being here. Um, and again, if you're not already, make sure to hit that subscribe button. And if you like this video, I hope you give it like a thumbs up. Leave me a nice comment down in the comment section. But I hope to see you in the next one.